Hello ladies and gentlemen, Groovy Guy here. Today we're going to be having a look at Titans Return Sea Spray. And there's a couple of interesting things about this toy. Uh, one of the first things that I found interesting was his uh, character card. You can see there's his uh, specs there. But the weird thing about it is it shows him in his alternate mode, which I thought was a bit weird. The only other two Scout or Legends uh, cards I've got are for Roadburn and Brawn, and they're both portrayed as their uh, robots. But for some reason, Sea Spray is only memorable as a uh, hovercraft. Anyway, that's weird. Uh, I don't usually show the cards anyway, but I thought that was just a bit weird to have the character art as the alternate mode. Anyway, here is Sea Spray, and he is pretty big for a um, Legends or a Scout size vehicle. Um, he's actually pretty big, like a really, really, really small Deluxe. Or a really, 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 really big Legends class. Um, he can, if you open up the back here, for some reason mine's really difficult to open. I think it's because the... Uh, there we go. This tab here is a bit too big. It sort of really gets dug into the white part. But anyway, you can uh, fit a Titan Master. There he is, Tesla. Anyway, um, you just got to be mindful when you do close it back. You got to move his faceplate back because he's got visible face syndrome. So you just got to put that back there like that. Uh, other than that, it's not really much else. He does have this accessory, which is just his gun in robot mode. That's pretty cool. Um, he's got an underside. He's got spinny little blades. But yeah, very big visible head syndrome. It is cool though that they've got the uh, flap there. Bah, 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 bah. Anyway, not much else to say about the uh, vehicle mode. It is a, it does look really, really big when you have it in a hand. Any dirty comments will be removed. Uh, so yeah, I'll be right back with his robot mode. All right, and we're back with Sea Spray in his robot mode. And <laughs> he's looked really far away, doesn't he? Um, another interesting thing is his gun. He doesn't have the, uh, the post. Instead, one of the actual clippy parts goes into one of the, uh, little slots on his hand. So, there's the slot. There's the tab. And it just gets slotted in. Which is just another interesting thing about this guy. Um, he looks really cool. Bit of a tubby guy. But uh, I think this is a really good rendition of Sea Spray. Um, now I don't have a, uh, a G1 Sea Spray to do a comparison. The closest thing I have at the moment on hand is this iGear Sea Spray, which I'm selling at the moment. Well, trying to. So it's just really nice to have an official Sea Spray. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I sort of said it in a weird way. But uh, yeah, it's just nice to have an official Sea Spray toy. Uh, here he is, of course, with Galvatron. <laughs> so yeah, um, here he is compared with a Deluxe. So his vehicle mode looks pretty big for a Legends, but uh, his robot mode is pretty much on par for the course when it comes to uh, scale. So yeah, there's a quick look at Sea Spray. A worthy addition to any collection.